What's up YouTube and Instagram? It's your Wake Up Curbs. Give me guys another episode on what's inside the box. Let's find out. All right, and so I just received my package from Funko. Sorry if I'm kind of whispering, it is late at night, so I'm just recording this as I go because I, I just don't want to wait till tomorrow to find out. But this package is like all indented in the corner, like it is smashed. Like if All Might literally just punched the crap out of this uh, box. Which I'm a little bit worried about the pop inside because that's that's big. That's a big indent. So well, let's find out if everything looks good in here. So, ooh, I'm not liking the way this box looks because it's kind of like indented there. Um, let's find out. I need to open this. Actually, I thought it was just gonna be open, but let's find out. Wow, this is literally opening up without me putting that much effort. Which is kind of a little bit worried because uh, that's a slide off really quickly. Alright. Three, two, one. The moment of truth. Please be okay. And it is safe and sound. Great. Uh, I was a little bit worried about uh, the pop being damaged, but this is black light carnage. Now, this is my first black light. Um, to ever seen in person because I actually bought the spider-man one I'm I'm about to review that one whenever it comes in but technically this one came in first so it is my first black light uh, from Marvel and pop anything you know black light uh, this pop looks amazing like I'm not even gonna lie this thing looks sick so we're gonna also take this out of the box to see how it looks in the dark especially with the black light and whatnot all right, and so this is Blacklight Carnage out of the box. Now, overall, this pop looks cool. I've never held a marble pop outside of the box, so this is my first time seeing the bobblehead in person. And it's pretty cool. It's actually pretty awesome. I love the pink and blues that this uh, pop has, and specifically the neon green on its eyes. This thing is just fantastic. It is weld made specifically for this Blacklight series. Now, let's find out how it looks in the black light okay yeah it's not doing any much justice but you can kind of see on this is not a glow-in-the-dark pop you got to remember that so it is kind of hard to tell but without shining it too much into it it looks cool um, it does look very bright when you put it but it's just too bright to, for the camera to catch um, but this is black light carnage. I'll post some pictures instead because it's just it's literally impossible to view it But under this light it looks pretty cool. I'm not gonna lie. It looks Really awesome. Uh, I just wish you guys could see it, but it's just too much for um, The camera to handle so I'll just go ahead and post pictures Overall, I'm very happy about this pop and you know, I'm very glad that I was able to get my hands on this when it got restocked because I was like, oh man, I missed my chance. If they're going to make more Blacklight series for uh, Spider-Man, I'm definitely going to keep on collecting it. I'm not going to bother collecting Iron Man and the other ones because it will be just too much. But if they do Spider-Man like Venom and all the other villains, then I'm okay with that. I, I actually want to collect the Blacklight series for uh, Spider-Man. But we'll find out in the future if they keep on releasing them. Let me know in the comments below what's your thoughts of this pop specifically. Um, if you like it, if you think it's really awesome. Let's talk about it. Have an awesome day or night. Peace.